Hey guys, this is Mr. Marshall with Mesa RC Full Fighters. I've got Cody here, and uh, I'm finally making some progress on Ken's design that he kind of did about a year and a half ago. I think he's been working on it ever since then. Um, Cody was really interested in working on the project. Ken wanted this, his plans to be done in CAD, and uh, Cody uh, volunteered to take over the, um, the pieces and, and get, the, you know, get the plan put together, and then hopefully get this thing in CAD by Christmas time. So, Cody, why don't you talk about the build and what was uh, some of the good things about the build and what do you plan on possibly changing in your in the final? Overall, it was pretty good. Uh, I think one thing we gotta change is maybe the canopy a little bit. Maybe put some hinges up here so it just opens up. And maybe make a little motor mount area for it. Cool. Um, how, you know, these this uh, airfoil was kind of tricky. How how did you end up doing that? Well, what we ended up doing is beveling in the inside of it, and then keep bending in until, and then threw some glue in there with some tape on top. Cool. The plane that actually ended up being, came out pretty nice. Uh, he's got it about 90% done. Uh, all we need to do is just mount the rest of the servos and stuff, or the uh, equipment on there. He's got the servos mounted. Um, this is a very unique plane due to the fact that, you know, Ken was trying to master a wing without vertical stabilizers. And uh, we've got these stabilizers in the back here, um, but Cody, you're trying to, you know, trying to learn from Ken, what, how is he, or how is he going to be able to control this plane without vertical stabilizers? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Like what are, I think they, I remember they put these up on here. The little draft Spacers, plates? Yeah. And so hopefully, and what, from what you guys saw from Ken, um, you know, these drag plates help to slow the plane down. Um, on this left and right turn and kept it stable. We also had to put these extra things on here. Okay. The wing tips. So, I think what you know when me and Cody or I was watching Cody build this thing, you know there was a lot of um, there's a lot of uh, things that we can do to enhance the build. I think it's going to make we're going to make the plans a lot you know easier for the user. Um, and I think you know this is being your first build. Um, I think you did a pretty good pretty good job. And you see this thing in the video, it looks, looks sharp. Um, and uh, hopefully it's going to fly as good as it looks. You've got to give it to Ken though, this is a pretty unique idea with the wings, uh, with the airfoil like Cody was talking about, how it kind of folds over like a little hook. Yeah. So he's got pretty much a KFM 4, um, and he's got a top piece and a bottom piece, and he bends it at the front, yeah. and it creates that airfoil. But what it also does, this thing is super, super strong. And so I think Cody's gonna like this because um, you can land this thing on the ground a couple times and still grab it and throw it back up. So um, what we're using for it, we wanna give him the best flight possible. So we got brand new Turnigy, uh, the, the TGY uh, 90s, the popular ones that are only 499 off Hobby King. Um, and then we're using the Spectrum Controller DX5. He's got just a regular Supo on there, 22-12-6. And we're using a lipo, uh, just a regular 30C 2200 milliamp uh, lipo. So um, I'm excited for Cody to get this thing out there to actually see what he can do, and um, I'm excited to actually get to team up with him and work on our the, the CAD plans for this. Um, of course, we'll run it by Ken, and Ken will approve them, and then we'll go ahead and get started. So, any last words? No. Nope. You ready to go fly? Yep. All right, let's go fly this thing. Hey guys, we are out here on a Wednesday. Uh, Monday was too windy for Mesa Day, so Cody's gonna be flying this solo without his partners there. But we're about ready to take this bad boy up and uh, see how it flies. Um, the plans are done for it, and that uh, we're actually they're getting done for it. Yeah. And we should have the plans out sometime after Thanksgiving. So. Well, let's hope this thing flies, and uh, as soon as I get it up there, I'll hand it off to you.
got a little 2212 in here and this thing is it's kicking butt. This is a slow guy. It's windy too today. So right now we got it flying. <laughs> nah, it's a little too windy. Okay, let's get some low flybys so you guys can see it. A little low on that pass by. That's okay, I'm gonna let Cody start flying this thing now. Okay. Okay. 